when a man goes in the seminary and comes to know what God's will is for him, even if that's not going on to be a priest, that's still success. What happens with many men, though, that they, they go in the seminary, and as time goes on, they keep asking the question, Lord, is this what you want me to do? Should I continue on in the seminary? And as our Lord confirms that, um, it, there often comes a time where a man is then convinced, I am being called to the, to the priesthood. The good news is, too, through the seminary formation, uh, the, the church is also confirming that the man is demonstrating the qualities to be a good priest, the qualities to be a holy priest, and the qualities to be a happy priest. And so as the, the seminary faculty representing the whole church is confirming you know, all the external realities that, that would point to you know, that God's calling you to the priesthood, you know, the man through his spiritual director is affirming the interior attributes that is consistent with the call to the priesthood. And so that way, when a man makes it to that, that, that wondrous day, when he's being ordained and committing himself as a priest, he has had years of discernment under his belt, and he can be very confident at that point that his commitment is a commitment that he has prepared well for and has discerned God's will well for it, and he, he then will know it's God's will. So it's more of a process than a moment, though um, everyone's vocation story has very mo great moments of clarity when it comes to you know, affirming God's will and seeing clearly God's will. Um, and the good news is then the church also affirms if God's calling a man to the priesthood or not.